Hi guys, um, so I was thinking of doing a little video uh, for an update on my guitar, uh, electric guitar to be exact. So we've played the bass, the bass kind of familiar with, uh, but we've been learning recently the chords and where they are, well the notes and where they are all placed. Uh, cool trick, if you are trying to learn and you don't want to YouTube every note you could get your tuner stick it on the end and just and you'll then the tuner will say the note so you can then write that down notes and then over time remember them and learn them memorize them so that when it comes round you can learn the note just the end. also a cool trick I learned is hit the first fret here on the high well, there we go high string here, uh, second fret on the high E, uh, low E string I mean, um, and that's your first note, which should be a F, F, F flat, C, G flat, and then by the time you get down to the seventh, uh, seventh fret, or seventh uh, down from the top on the uh, low E string that would be the last note and then you would start back up here so and then if you went any higher you would come back to this first but a little a little higher like to play a little song that I learned so this is an easy one that you can follow along if you want to so you get the open E string the first one at the very top like so now the one below it the A A string you want to put your whatever finger you want to use I will prefer using my index first finger uh, put it on the second fret on here, the second one, and then try and push it so that it's down, flat down over that one and the one just behind it. So the uh, A and the D string, second fret, so one, two, three strings down, those two there want to be on, and the top one open, and plucked out together you should get this. And then you go three times. Now cross over to your middle finger, hit the third string, third third note on the A string, which should be a a F no a, a G. And then go back to that same chord that I showed you there. Play that one more time. And then now you can do it one of two ways. You can go back to that same note and then back. I oh, know. So no no, you go you go scratch that. After you play this note here, you don't go back to the same note, you go you do it, but you go one across. One across down. So instead of doing this note here. You go one down, so you're now doing the open on the string just below A, so just below the very top one, that one open, then you go down two more, one, two, and you strum those three simultaneously, or you can do it one at a time if you want to make it sound really snazzy. go back to that that note that single note we did hit that and then back to the original opening and in total you should make it sound like this
there's this one more section that you might want to learn as well for this song, which is at the very bottom, you'll see these two dots right here. These two dots is the it, it is the twelfth fret, and you want to play the uh, the G string, the second to the very bottom. So that last string go up one. That's the sound it should make on an open. Now you want to see the twelfth here. You want to go one, two, three down from that, which should be the fifteenth fret down and you want to hit this now go two more down then back now go up here back to the 12th fret then go up one string wise so you're going to hit the D string no you're going to you're going to hit the okay so this this note is a is the B string so And it should be the G, G string, pluck here, no, yeah, yeah, here, 14th note, so 12th, 1, 2, down, and then here, on the 12th, 12th fret, and then you go back up here and play that first riff. <laughs> just now learnt the main guitar bit of uh, I, I love I love rock and roll and so do you now and also I wanted to show something so you know I played the Arctic Monkeys um, on the bass this part <laughs> this I'm gonna teach you this part uh, bit by bit. So, so the first bit, which is, so you start on the the high uh, the 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 low A, uh, A, E string E string, yep, yeah, and hit that not open. So you hit the second fret uh, right here. It should be a F flat or F sharp, however you want to say it. I do not know the correct which one it is, but it is one of the two. It's an F with like a hashtag next to it. Hit this, and then you want to hit that twice. Go down one string uh, to the to the A. Same note, same 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 spot, just a bit down one string. And then slide down the neck slightly, down two, back up to that one. Now the fifth one, this should be noted, it's the second one here with a dot, so you got one dot, two dot. Hit that hit that one there. Back up. 
no, uh, not back up. Um, then, after you hit this one, you want to slide it down. See the 12th here? The, the two dots? Two down from that, hit the 14th note. And then go back up here to where you started on the first string on the second fret on the on the E string again. So you wanna repeat this three times. So instead of sliding back down, you go back up the neck and then just hit this uh, open. Open after this last second, second note here and then open. Back to the first note here, the, the second fret on the first string. Now you want to bend it by just wiggling the note. Then go back to this fifth note here on the second string. Just like that. And then here's a cool trick. After this part, now you know there's two sections here. You know the... You know that part? Now, all we need to know is this part here. May sound familiar. So, same beginning at the very start, where you put the second second string on the first note. Uh, no, second fret on the first string. Hit that twice. Now go down across one, just like we did. When we were sliding it, hit that. Now the fourth note. Go down one more string. So we're going down like this way. Hit the second bear. Now do the same on this, the fourth one as well. Then down one more string, but we hit the second note again, which should sound like this. Then we go back on the fourth, up one again to the, the two, back to the five on the second string, hit that three times, now the fourth, second, hit that three times, open, now the second on the first string. So now, if we speed this up, it should sound like this. Now, if you want, you can pause the video or slow it down a bit so that you can hear those notes. Might help if I had to pick the right way. I messed up now. Oh, you throw me off now. And there you go. Now you know the song. And if you want, that I can put in the link to the tabs I found for the song. Uh, if you want to follow along. Uh, and you can listen to live recordings and you'll hear the bass note and, and all of that in it. You can just tap along to it and the, the bass goes down every every time you hit four notes. So, bass. Bass there again. Bass. And if you 
notes, and it's every fourth note. That's if you want to use a metronome. I definitely wouldn't recommend it. They will drive you insane, just like if you have a clock. So uh, don't use a metronome if you want. Just listen to the drums in the background. Don't use a metronome. It will drive you insane. Okay, guys, and uh, here's one more. Uh, you may you may know this already, but if you don't, it's a quick song that you can learn in about five seconds. So, starting off on the second note again, and then down one string uh, onto the A again, uh, and third note go down one, fourth fourth note basically, then fifth. Hit that three times. Second. Oh, first. So after we hit this fourth, uh, go up two. Back down. Now open on on the same note. And then back to the two. So it should go two, four, five, uh, two, four, five, five, two, four, two, open two, four, five, five, two, four, two, open two. And there you go. That is uh, Arctic Monkeys. Uh, do you want to know? No, why do you always come and want to know hi? Uh, do you want to know is a different one. This this is how you do. Do you want to know? Let's break this up. So the first opening bit is on the on the A, the highest the highest on this here, this one right here that I'm pointing to. First note at the very top that you can hit. Hit that once. Now the third note. Back to the first. Back to the third. And then we do this again the second time. This is where it changes. Nope. Uh, so. Retry, scratch that. Did it wrong. First, first note, down two, third. Now the second note, uh, second string across, go top one. Then back to the third on the first string. So you do that once, and then you do it again. But now, instead of going back, we slide it down. To the third note on this second string. Hit that. And then down slide two to the fifth. And then now we change it. We go back to the top. Hit that first string. Third. Finger off, lift. Play that open. Then back down. Hit the third again. Now back to the top. One. One, two, three. First string number three. And then we do that again. We loop it. So.
that's four songs learn in the course of 20 minutes. Oh. You're welcome. Thanks for watching, and hopefully we can do some more guitar tips, or bass tips if you want. Leave a comment if which one you want next.